guys welcome back to my channel so basically i'm going somewhere because we're having a lot of issues with like lens people trying to sell our lens and things like that yeah that's Cameroon for you you can never sit put and be comfortable and just feel like there's nothing going on you will just be sleeping people will be calling you hey they're trying to sell your lens so that's what um that's where i'm going guys that's where i'm going so i'm gonna catch you guys later <music> Hey guys, so I'm here on the site. These guys are trying to measure the land. <clears throat> Let me just. Okay, there's so much. I'm past that. So guys, um, let me go ahead and explain to you what is currently going on. So this is what happened. A couple days ago, we got a phone call uh, from somebody who lives in the neighborhood. Got a phone call saying that there were a bunch of people in, <clears throat> in the area, you know, where the land is. It's a long story because the tidal, <sighs> you know Cameroon, when it comes to... Wait, hold up. My brother is showing me something. It's the same no, it's the same height, actually. So the land title got cancelled for everybody in the area. So everybody living around here, everybody land title got cancelled. So now we kind of like reinstating our own. So on Monday, my brother got another phone call saying that he has to come urgently because there are people on the site. So he drove because <laughs> he was in a, I mean, you know, my brother is a civil engineer, so he's always in a construction site. So my brother drove all the way came here and saw some people like a group of like 10 12 people so he called me he was like hey there are people on our land and they're talking about selling buying all of these things so because Cameroon is the way Cameroon is if you guys know you know if you buy land in Cameroon you never secure like it's not because you bought land that you have the title that everything is good to go okay because there are people who are always going to be stealing um the government or somebody can decide to just cancel your title and you have to do the whole procedure again so that's what has been happening Whew. and this is not the only <laughs> i'm just walking a lot i need to do some exercise so this is not the only um issue that we have with lens um we have other issues <laughs> We're currently having the guys back there doing land surveying and yeah so this is the plan we're planning to do um to put fences around the whole area so that you know whenever people are showing up in order to buy our land because if people see that you put fences and then you put like um some signs saying that this is a private area they're not going to be i mean people are not going to be buying it um even though somebody is trying to sell it to you so i'm going to show you a little bit of what we're going to do so this is we're gonna do something like that you see how they have fences here but ours i don't know if we're gonna put this type um we're gonna do something because ours is really big the land is huge and guys as much as i want to spend <laughs> money i don't want to spend that much so this is something like that we're gonna do we're gonna put just things like three or four of them and it's gonna look something like that so yeah, that's the plan. We have to do it this week. And in addition to doing that, um, I also asked the guys and my brother to build like a, like a little in cabin, like a little wood house. I don't know how you call it, like a cottage house, something like that, like something small, right? Um, and then on the wall, on the outer part of the house, we're gonna put um, private property, something like that. Uh, we're also gonna put like, signs all over the land i don't know if i'm 
really doing a good job explaining all of that but that's basically what i'm planning to do um so i'm just waiting for my brother to let me know how much all of it is gonna cost and then we're just gonna go ahead and do it sometime this week <sighs> that's the plan the annoying thing with cameroon you guys already know like it's just annoying because you can never sleep really peacefully without somebody telling you there's some drama going on and so forth if you guys watch my video where i was talking about the school guess what the same thing happened i was doing construction last year um to prepare additional classrooms at the school and then you guys i mean i had to stop all the construction that's why i never showed you guys the finished products of the that new construction building you know at school because I got a letter saying that the government the state was gonna come and demolish the school if you haven't watched the video where I'm explaining it all go ahead and watch it but yeah so that's pretty much the same thing you just wake up one day and then they tell you something is going on anyway guys so I'm gonna be talking to my brother um, he's still showing me some additional um, areas that we have to take into account because what happened is that we sold some of the land you know part of it we sold it to somebody else so i'm not going to put fences on that because whoever bought it they have to go ahead and i mean it's my cousin <laughs> my cousin is the one who bought it okay like he bought it he's going to be putting his own fence because i'm not going to be spending money like that you know anyway so that's what's currently going on and we're just going to monitor the activities on the site and see if these guys you know are coming back here to buy our land or something so anyway cameroon is so annoying can never be at peace. So annoying. Maintenant, il faut, je ne sais pas si c'est abonné. Non. Oh. C'est possible. Oh my god, guys. Some ant just. Ooh, I got beaten by some ants. <laughs> And it hurts. I'm just running away. <laughs> I actually dropped my phone because of how bad. Oh my god, my leg. We're asking one of those guys how much it's gonna cost to cut all the grass, all of it. So yeah. Apparently that snake's here, so the guy said that the snake beat him today. <laughs> so he doesn't want to start working today. But yeah, it's a lot of um, a lot of trees, guys. Anyway, we're trying to figure it out because we have to remove. I mean, this entire land has to be empty. So that's the goal. Um, and then we're gonna build a little little house there. It's just gonna be built with wood, no cement whatsoever, just wood, because nobody's gonna be living here. We just need something that's gonna be, you know, looking like there's a life here or something. Anyway. Mais l'ensemble, on te dit que c'est 2000 mètres carrés. S'il faut défricher 2000 mètres carrés. En argent. So the the entire land that we wanna uh, put fences around is 2,000 square meter. Guys, so this is gonna be the end of this rant. I feel like I was ranting. Was I ranting? <laughs> I was just, I'm just pissed. I was supposed to be at school today. It's already 12:09. There's no way I'm gonna be there today, okay? Because I was supposed to be there for my new hire, my accountant. I'm still sort of training her. <clears throat> I gave her like a computer because all my stuff at school. The office staff, they all have um, computers. So I was supposed to make sure that the computer was set up and everything. But I did not make it today. So I'm just waiting for my brother. He's negotiating on how much it's going to cost for these guys to kind of like get rid of all of this. But anyway, guys, I'm going to talk to you in the next vlog. If there's any updates, as usual, I will let you know. Um, yeah, I have a stuffy note. So. 
I'm kind of tired. I think it's just the weather. It's been raining a lot. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Bye. One thing that I wanted to say and close this video on is if you're planning to come to Cameroon, Cameroon is going to drive you crazy and it will make you go broke. This is not even a joke. Cameroon will make you go broke. There are so many things that you don't even plan on spending money on that you end up spending the money on. Like, it's crazy. And right now, for the land surveying that we're doing, it costs us 150000 that's not even you know and we still have to do the fences we still have to do the little you know wood house and, and all of these things so anyway i just wanted to say that on here because guys everything is pricey i mean i guess if you have some type of properties or anything like that you have to spend money Whew, anyway. bye guys bye. Don't, don't forget to like and subscribe bye